So, President Moon is nearing the end of his nine-day trip to Europe. The South Korean leader has already garnered support for his peace drive from two key uh, European players, namely France and Italy. But he's looking to take it to the next level in Brussels, as he'll have plenty of face time, not only with European, but other Asian leaders as well. Our Hwang Ojun with the details. President Moon's tour of Europe continues in Brussels before stop on his five-nation tour to the continent. During his roughly 48 hours in the Belgian capital, the South Korean leader is going to be on a diplomacy blitz, with most of his attention on North Korea. The president will attend the Asia-Europe meeting, or ASEM, on Friday local time, where he will hold bilateral meetings with British Prime Minister Theresa May, German Chancellor Angela Merkel, and Prayut Fanocha, Prime Minister of Thailand. If all goes as scheduled, President Moon will have met with the leaders of at least four European heavyweights, firming up broad international support for his push to denuclearize the Korean Peninsula. Before departing Brussels, a summit with EU leaders. The main focus is shoring up cooperation with Seoul's partners in the EU and to hopefully speed up the peace process. The president's Europe tour wraps up in Copenhagen, where he will take part in the inaugural summit of the Partnering for Green Growth and the Global Goals 2030, otherwise known as the P4G. Hwang Wojun, Arirang News.